blessings and peace, people of God. Hallelujah. 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 God is good. He's faithful, y'all. I pray that your week is going well. I want to encourage somebody on today. I heard the Spirit of the Lord say, you're not being punished. You're being pressed. Oh, Jesus. I know it's hard. I know it's uncomfortable. I know this season is not fun. I'm not enjoying it. It's not feeling good to me. Things don't seem like they're lining up right now. It doesn't seem like it's making sense. I can't quite put it together, Lord. I don't know what's going on. I feel like that you told me to do this or you told me to do that. I've turned this. I've turned from that. I've did this. I've done that. I don't know, God, but I'm still not quite. The Spirit of the Lord. Oh, Jesus. God, I bless your name. Hallelujah. The report of the Lord is you are not being punished. You are being pressed. Hallelujah. Oh, Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. It's the reckless love of God that's going to show out in your life in this season doesn't have to make sense you just got to hold on to your faith with everything you have you got to hold on you got to be still and know that God is still God you got to be still and know that he has not moved the report of the Lord is you are not being punished you are being pressed my God the Lord is updating your testimony in this season who if they thought you had a testimony before Oh, Jesus, if they thought you had fire, you were on fire for God before. After this, my Lord, oh, Jesus, glory, hallelujah. See, a lot of people hear elevation, oh, it's an elevation season. But what we forget is that with the with the elevation, there comes a pressing. Come on, there comes preparation. There are some things you got to go through to get to the next level. God, I bless your name. Hallelujah. I love when people got that report. Listen, somebody just said they got out of the hospital uh, for COVID. That means the Lord healed you. He touched your body. He's still healing. He's still delivering, my God. I love it. Whenever I can look back over my life and remember that the same God, hey, that delivered me the same God that saved me the same God that healed me he's still on the throne he still sits high he still looks low I have never seen the righteous forsaken nor his seed begging for bread it is the report of the Lord who Jesus glory it's the reckless love of God it's the reckless love of God hallelujah who Jesus that's coming for you in this season don't get discouraged people of God keep pressing hold on to your faith with everything in you my God oh God I bless your name listen who there is no wall that he won't kick down coming after you my God who Jesus hallelujah hallelujah there's no shadow he won't light up God I bless your name I just believe that God is getting ready to do something in this season but the temperature had to be right for a miracle you had to be in lack for him to be provider you had to be sick for him to be healer you had to be in a situation for him to be deliverer my God whoo Jesus hallelujah hallelujah glory God I bless your name God, I bless your name. You're good to us, God. Hallelujah. Who Jesus. Hallelujah. The Lord is stopping by to see on his, about his children. He's stopping by. He's stopping by checking on his children. My God. Who Jesus. Just hold on just a little while longer. Just hang tight just a little while longer. God hears your prayers. He sees your tears. My God, he knows the things that you are going through, but he also knows how he's going to solve that very solution and how you're going to come out on the other side with a new praise who jesus how you going to come out on the other side with fresh fire my god how you going to come out on the other side with new authority my god who jesus god i bless your name he's a good god he's a good god y'all he's a good god the report of the lord is you are not being punished you're being pressed you're being pressed you're, you're being pressed, my God. I remember when I was paralyzed. And I remember laying in the bed and I was like, Lord, I had surrendered my life to you right before. I, and then I get sick. What? That don't even make no sense. I had surrendered my life. I had turned from my wicked ways. And then I get sick. 
And the Lord said, I had to allow the anointing to thicken. Come on, Jesus. He said, I had to allow the anointing to thicken. My God, it's like when you're making a sauce on the stove and you got to turn that heat up and just let that heat be constant. My God, that heat is just constant right now, but it's producing something. And as the water begins to boil out, because some of us have been watered down, God, I bless your name. As the water begins to boil out, the concentration of this liquid, the, the, the fluid, the, the, um, sauce in the pot it begins to thicken and that's the same thing that God is doing with our anointing in this season he's doing a new thing but you got to be willing to stay in the fire my God you got to be willing to stay in the heat believe that God is God know that he is not a man that he shall lie nor the son of man that he shall repent you've heard this before this is no new report you know what God has spoken over your life you just have to believe in it in this season don't get distracted by the presence of problems problems will always be here my God there's always gonna be something but keep your eyes on the prize if you fall down get up Come on, get up, knock the dust off of your knees and get your hand back to the plow in this season. Be not distracted, children of God. Be not dismayed, God is not mocked. My God. Oh, Jesus, he don't need no help being God. He is God all by himself. He sits high and he looks low. The wind and the waves obey his command. He is God. Oh, Jesus, God, I bless your name. Don't be discouraged. Don't get weary in well-doing in this season, child of God. Stay the course. It's the report of the Lord. Stay the course. Stay the course. Where else you gonna go? You gotta get like Peter. Peter told Jesus. Jesus said, well, who else are you gonna leave to? Jesus said, well, Peter said, well, where else I'm gonna go? <laughs> That's how I feel about it. I don't even got nowhere else to go. Come on. My God. So I just wanted to encourage somebody today. I pray that that encouraged you. I pray that this is going to give you a little more strength to keep pressing. Keep pressing, child of God. We're going to get through this. We're going to get through this. I'm so excited that we're coming through some of this stuff with COVID. That a lot of places are dropping the mask stuff. And it's not as so tight. People can go in hospitals with their peep family and have children and be in the room with the children and so on and so forth. So it's easing up in that aspect. But at the end of the day, listen. The only real peace is in heaven. So we got to we gotta stop crying so much when people pass away. When people pass away and they soul is saved, bless God. The Bible said it's a time to celebrate. We got to get that right because this world is wicked. This world is evil. It's lost. It's a dying world. But God has called us to be the remnant. To stay the course. Keep your hand to the plow. Believe God with all your strength all your might and all your soul you got to have unshakable faith in this season god i still believe Woo, jesus hallelujah god i still believe i encourage you to type that on the screen god i still believe god i bless your name who jesus mm, mm, mm. hallelujah god is faithful y'all god is faithful he's good he's good He's a good God. Well, I ain't going to hold y'all. I just wanted to encourage you a little bit that was on my heart to let you know that you are not being punished. You're being pressed. There's something that will be produced from this that you had to be pressed for. The olive does not produce oil without the pressing. The grape cannot produce wine without the crushing my god so i know you that pressure yes baby it's real it's real it's, it's, it's that pressure god if you don't show up come on that's that pressure if, if you don't do it god come on the doc the medication is not working god if you don't heal me i won't be healed if if you don't pay the bill god i'm gonna be homeless if you don't if you don't pay the bill or we're not gonna have food come on at the end of the day that's that pressure it's that pressure but as you keep holding on, you're going to see a miracle. You're going to see a miracle. You're going to see diamond miracles break out in your life. Stay in the pressure. God, I still believe you. I don't like it. Oh, Jesus, I don't like it. But God, I believe that your word is true. The Bible says, after you have suffered a little while, the God of all grace is faithful. To restore, establish, and place you on a firm foundation. People of God. Oh, Jesus. 
Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord, on today. You're good, God. You're merciful, and you are a kind, God. You're loving. You are all-knowing. You are all-seeing, God. Lord, we ask for strength on today as we go through the pressing of our life. We go through the pressing seasons, God, as we are being pressed out and the anointing is being birthed out through some of us. Some of us are in our carrying season. Some of us are getting ready to birth out a thing, God. But whichever way this thing goes, we call on you today, Lord, for strength. We call on you today, God, to be our strong tower. We call on you today, God, to be our healer. We call on you today, God, to be a mighty deliverer. Is there anything too hard for God? Oh, Jesus, God, I bless your name. We know that all things are possible to those who believe. We know that all things are possible. And Lord, we still believe your word is true. We still believe that you're still healing. We believe that you're still delivering. We believe that you're still saving, God. We believe that the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. God, we thank you for your holy. You're a holy God. You're merciful and you are kind. We love you on today, God. We love you on today, God. Thank you, Lord, for your good. Don't let us fold under pressure. Hallelujah. 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 Send a ram in the bush. My God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory. I hear the Spirit of the Lord saying, Some of you I'm purifying through the fire. I'm purifying you just like in the days of Noah, my God. It was the washing of the world and all things were made new. There are some things that you're going through. It's uncomfortable and things are shifting all around you. And, and it's just a washing of your life. People are leaving your life. You're holding on to them with all you got, but they still slipping through your fingers. Some people have lost jobs. Some people have lost sources of income. Some people have lost their home. But God has said, I'm washing. All things are going to be made new. And it's going to be better than your past. So I just want to encourage somebody on today. Be blessed, people of God. Hold on. If God be for you, he's greater than the world against you. Blessings and peace, people of God. I'm Apostle Julia, and I'll see you next time.